हेलो फ्रेंड वेलकम टू द चैनल फार्मेसी डिक्शनरी वी हैव जस्ट फिनिश्ड आवर यूनिट वन ऑफ फार्माकोलॉजी वन सो नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू सी द बेसिक स्पेसिमेन क्वेश्चन और मॉडल क्वेश्चन पेपर आई मस्ट से फॉर योर सेशनल एग्जामिनेशन पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू As per new PCI syllabus, this question paper has bifurcated into three sections. The section one will be of multiple choice question. Here you have to attend any of the twenty questions, and then after you have to go for the long answer type question and respectively for short answer type of question. So let's discuss about the section one that is multiple choice question. One more important thing: you can download this question paper in PDF just by clicking a simple link. given in the description box so if you are interested to download such question paper for all upcoming units then you can follow the same procedure just check description box so the first question of section 1 multiple choice question says the study of pharmacokinetic and pharmacodynamic is known as here it is a pharmacokinetic please correct is a pharmacodynamic your options are pharmacogenomics microbiology pharmacology or embryology i am giving the answer but in question paper you will get the answer sheet separately at the last of this question paper sheet so the right answer is pharmacology because pharmacology is all about the study of kinetic as well as dynamic profile so now next question what does drug do to the body is called as the question says what does drug so see the drug is coming first at this questions so the drug doing anything with our body is simply known as a pharmacodynamic so the right answer is b pharmacodynamic now coming to the next question that is pharmacokinetic is study about just opposite of the previous one so it is body response for the drug taken drug action on the body both of them or none of the them so the right answer is a body response for the drug taken suppose it is a drug here the drug is taken by any of the patient then somehow this drug can produce action so the action is producing by drug that is why it is called dynamic but what is going to be happen inside the body that is a d m n e and all this a d m e is done by body so what is a kinetic what does body do to the drug is simply known as the pharmacokinetic i have already explained this in my uh, lecture video so coming to the next question definition of drug most accurate definition in general people think that drug is a agent which is used for the treatment of any disease but no this is not correct exactly the drug is a agent which is used either for treatment prevention and diagnosis so in the option all are present for the treatment for the prevention for the diagnosis so the right answer will be d all of the above our right answer is d coming to the next question that is says penicillin was discovered by this is important question you should remember it in case of microbiology also penicillin was discovered by sir alexander fleming this is a direct question no tricky option as there next one is paul enrich is known as father of chemotherapy father of botany father of zoology or none of the above this is very important he is known as a father of chemotherapy now coming to the next question the question number 7 asks a drug which should be available at a low price and sufficient quantity is called see there are two characteristic feature required in this question these are at a low price and a sufficient quantity so which of the following possess this features essential drug orphan drug buffer drug or all of the above all of the above will not be a right answer because here is a wrong answer or wrong option available that is b b is wrong option so d cannot be the right answer what is the right answer here essential drug those drug which should be possessed or which should be kept at any condition at a low price and a sufficient quantity is simply known as the essential drug and the concept behind this list is called essential drug concept which is very important governing factor for formulary point of view coming to the next question it is asking about the drug given by intravenous route is called so the route of administration the question is all about route what is called if we will introduce or give the drug via iv directly to your veins parenteral topical enteral or local all option are very important so you should eliminate all those option which seems wrong so first of all local because it is giving in blood so how it can be local so the right answer is not local next enteral enteral means via intestine so it is not going through the oral route so this is also wrong answer just remove it next one is topical the question is intricate that means we are giving in the blood so how it could be a topical there is only one option remaining that is parenteral that's why this will be the right answer will be a parenteral root of drug administration coming to the next question agent which proceed the drug action option are there agonist antagonist 
इनवर्स एगोनिस्ट और नन ऑफ द एव जस्ट फोकस ऑन द क्वेश्चन एजेंट विच प्रोसीड द ड्रग एक्शन दैट मीन्स एजेंट इज फैसिलिटेटिंग और सपोर्टिंग द एक्शन ऑफ ड्रग इज कॉल्ड सो सी एंटागोनिस इज जस्ट एंटी एगोनिस इज एंटी and anti means just opposite so this is not a right answer this is wrong and inverse agonist inverse that means just opposite of the agonist so it is not a right answer also and none of the above because are there any option which is right yes these are option in this option the option a is right agonist because agonist which facilitate the action of drug in a proper manner or in a same direction so if the drug action is going to this side just for example agonist will also support the action of drug in this side but in case of antagonist it will try to antagonize the action of drug so right answer is agonist the option is a this is the right answer option a next question is question number 10 spare receptor is what is the meaning of spare spare means which is remaining unused is called spare so the options are remaining receptor finished receptor where is receptor means that is already being used next one is occupied what is the difference between finished and occupied nothing both are occupied that is why they are finished and damaged how can receptor damage that is not in the quantity so the right arms the right answer is a remaining receptor are also known as a spare receptor next question tachyphylaxis is a kind of tolerance dependence abuse or genetic defect this is a direct question the right answer is tolerance coming to the question number 12 conversion of drug into polar or water soluble substance is known obviously there is a adme process as we have studied in the previous one adme here m is representing the metabolism in case of metabolism it is trying to convert the non polar substance into polar substance or lipid soluble substance into water soluble substance so that it may get excreted from our body so obviously in the option absorption adsorption distribution and metabolism are given the absorption and adsorption are given just to make you confused so these are not right answer distribution cannot be the right answer the right answer is metabolism coming to the 13th question phase 1 reaction is also known as or phase 1 reaction in metabolism is also known as it is a specific options are non synthetic functionalization reaction or synthetic reaction or both a and b see the phase 1 reaction is having two other name non synthetic or functionalization reaction because addition of functional group is taking place in this phase so the right answer will be d both a and b c in option c synthetic reaction then how can it is possible that non synthetic and synthetic will be happen so this is wrong option only the d is right next question lipid soluble drug may be eliminated through bile milk saliva or all of the above lipid soluble drug is having property to get eliminated via all of this route so the right answer is d all of the above next questions ask which of the following is an example of principle of drug action that means how drug produce its action is called principle of drug action options are stimulation depression replacement all of the above this is a question of next unit but i have included in earlier because this is a very important options are correct with all options are correct so the right answer is all of the above i will explain you in upcoming unit next question cytochrome p450 is metabolic enzyme genetic enzyme inducer enzyme inhibitor enzyme so options are already confusing the b is totally wrong it may be chances of c or d but i have a clue to make your confusion away from your side that is enzyme inducer and inhibitor enzyme are not available these are the drug which can inhibit or induce the enzyme so these two are also wrong the right answer is metabolic enzyme next question receptor is macromolecule macromolecule genetic material ya yeah, all of the above the right answer is macromolecule it is also a question of your next unit next one a drug which has very rare use see very rare use is termed as essential drug it is not right answer because we have already seen about the essential drug concept orphan drug emergency drug all of the above essential drug is not a answer 
emergency is not because here is rare case all of the above it is not because two answer already been wrong so the right answer is orphan drug this is main answer of your question coming to the question number 19 the rate and extent of drug absorbed from this doses form is called here rate and extend these two are representing our answer is bioavailability so all these answer are wrong only bioavailability is a correct one so last question for section one protein binding may affect drug distribution drug absorption drug digestion or all of the above see if the drug is there this is drug and there are two chances for the drug if the drug will remain constant uh, remain free but in case of those condition drug will bind to a protein so this is called plasma protein binding and it will behave as a macro molecule like big size molecule so it will not be distributed easily so this is affecting drug distribution next is section 2 long answer type of question i'm not going to explain the answers because all answers are available in our lecture video series so questions ask define pharmacology explain pharmacokinetic and pharmacodynamic with suitable example also explain one landmark in pharmacology question number two explain root of drug administration all these questions are very important so you should prepare accordingly explain root of drug administration classify various root of drug administration with their respective advantage and disadvantage i have already uploaded many video regarding this and pdf is also available just you have to check his description box next question define drug what do you understand by the sources of drug explain with suitable example everything is explained in our video even pdf is also available so coming to the next one that is section 3 short answer type of question each question having five mark explain marine source and their give and give their importance question 2 explain tolerance and dependence tricky question is there what do you understand by the metabolism explain process in short or process of metabolism phases of metabolism what is agonist antagonist and inverse agonist you should define here explain idiosyncrasy and tachyphyl access explain enzyme induction and its clinical relevance it is very important explain combined effect of drug with suitable example explain essential drug concept and the last question explain cellular transport mechanism of drug so these are basic questions so if you will download the pdf you will not get an answer in a tick form you will get a separate answer key so that you may tally it after some time that was a question paper for your unit one thank you very much for watching this video hope you are enjoying this lecture with a fun thank you please do take care of yourself and all the best